Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So, Microsoft Edge version 135 is now rolling out, which is the latest release. And this would have rolled out late yesterday in my part of the world on the 3rd of April. Now, to double check, we have the update. As always, we head to our main menu, also referred to as the ellipsis menu. Help and feedback about Microsoft Edge. Latest version in bold is 135.0.3179.54. Now, once again, this is going to be what's new in Microsoft Edge 135, according to Brentech, because just like version 134, Microsoft hasn't posted the release notes or the change log. And this seems to be coming a common occurrence. Um, but nonetheless, just to go through what I think would be new in the browser and and obviously if there are any major changes to what I'm mentioning in the video after posting and um, when the release notes do become available, I'll obviously post and repost and keep you guys in the loop. Now, first of all, we would get bug and performance issue fixes. That's a given. Microsoft always rolls those out with any update for the browser. And there's a good chance there could be edge-specific security flaws that are patched. And one thing I do know is this will also include the weekly Chromium security fixes that have rolled out for Google Chrome and other Chromium-based web browsers, which includes 13 fixes. Now, overnight in my part of the world, while we are talking about the Chromium fixes, Google actually pulled one of the security fixes that had originally rolled out earlier this week. We had 14 and now we only have 13 and they've pulled the high severity floor and we only get now a couple of mediums and a couple of lows. So not too much major in the line of security issues um, with the Chromium based web browsers and there are no zero days exploited in the wild thankfully or any critical vulnerabilities. So Edge would include the 13 security fixes that have rolled out for Google Chrome and the other browsers. Now, when it comes to front-facing features, I'm not noticing anything on both my browsers on Windows 10 and Windows 11 when it comes to new front-facing features. Everything looks exactly the same as it was prior to version 135 rolling out. So I think that if there are adjustments and features that have been um, rolled out add-ons or updates i think those will be mainly taking place under the hood and would be regarding security or deprecations that microsoft is also known to do and then we would get our new policies and also deprecated policies that's a norm with any version upgrade so as mentioned Version 135 is available. If you are noticing anything new in your region after updating, just let me know in the comments. So um, obviously I can put it out there, but I'm not noticing anything new. And as mentioned, if anything major changes to what I've mentioned in this video, when the release notes do become available, I'll obviously repost and let you guys know. But 135, latest stable release is now rolling out for Microsoft Edge. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.